Hello, boys and girls! Welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included, where we have a problem up here. So let's switch this uh, lever here, uh, which will force the doors to close and stay closed. The reason we have a problem is because we do not have enough power. In fact, we have so... So few power that we cannot power the uh, scanners. Uh, that's why uh, the uh, doors uh, are playing haywire here. Um, and we did a bit of, of damage down here. So all the doors should eventually close and then stay closed. Which means we do not constantly need power to open and close the doors. Um, which should help a bit. In addition, we can also um, enable these uh, hamster wheels here. And what do we have? Operating, research, tidying, cooking, decorating, supplying. Cooking would be good, but I want cooking and building uh, optionally uh, or ideally combined with supplying. So we'll take the water as we are a bit low on water supply for for the cool water so now we do have enough power for these these doors are still closing here we are closed here we're missing a tile entirely. And then we have to, to clean up a bit here before progressing further, I think. And we have to figure out how we can ensure that we have power on here and the way I think we could do that is um, do we have something in here yeah wattage sensor that might be uh, helpful because um, let's place a coal generator here, then a smart battery, um, then a bit of uh, logic. Um, and then have a wire going through here and basically what we want is 
when the voltage here on the wire that we will connect to this one is low we should turn on the generator right okay so let's connect this wire up here and thereby be this coal generator then should run um, whenever we have not sufficient power uh, in order uh, to power the sensors. Okay, now. All the doors should now be closed. Yeah. Here, this one, um, we need to replace. And then, probably part of the problem is that we do not have. We do not have enough uh, battery storage, so let's just add two more rows here. Grab this out. And without solar power, we probably should not use that one. So, without any power stored, it might be a bit tricky to open the doors, operate the, the miners. And currently, uh, what's the state of our uh, natural gas gases? Both are dormant. Uh, 12 cycles and 31 cycles. That's an awful long time. So, maybe can just place two more engines here on uh, this side hook them up also this pipe And then we need also some cooling here. Let's bring that down to here and bridge over. Bridge over. And bridge over. Okay, 
that means we have to bridge here and here we have a uh, radiant pipe here here and here and here in between we will have radiant pipe and then we will connect up there once everything is built we will i will add a bridge there okay so that's a few things we can do to uh, help out with our power problem And then here, of course, um, we could go down here. Yep, let's plan this out as well. So if we go down here. We will go up there and then we shall have something like this it goes to here which we can potentially extend the other the, uh, further out and then let's bridge up here and bring this over like so and then the radiant pipes can be placed in later I think first priority should be on this here. That should get us more power. Then the next priority, I would guess, would be the fixing of everything up here. Then this is the, hmm, is it this or that? We probably should have more batteries to store energy uh, when we uh, open the doors. And to open the doors we need the power from down below. Um, Maybe disable this building. That should also save a bit of uh, of power. Down here we do not have anything. We're getting a bit steel, so we need to have this cycle running in order to um, keep the water in here cool enough. Um. Ooh, yep, that's 
That's not good. That. Um, this door. Here we have a broken. Yeah, we are no longer producing enough uh, oxygen for our base. Um, so, electrolyzer here. Do it quick. Temperatures. Here they are, they are too cold. Maybe we have too many uh, pipes for cooling. So let's switch out every other one. It's too cool for the for the plants here. Looks like uh, due to the stifled millwood grow, all our uh, glossy draglets, uh, save the young one, the draglet, has perished. Not good. Here, not so good. At least down here, we are making some progress. And let's plant the pieces of isolated uh, radiant pipe. Probably should hook them up to the to the same automation grid. At least this comes along. Uh, here we can lock again. Um, Okay, here we have power problems. Um, let's see. Operating, cooking, digging, building, supplying, digging. Almost. Almost. Um, are there any other machines I can turn off? Hmm. 
not that I can see. to get this finished and then we should be able to deal with uh, oxygen a bit better up here the air gets gets thin down here we are still good that comes from from mainly from from this side over here but here we have issues with the cooling. And looks like uh, our uh, storage here is becoming full. Okay, now they are running, then let's see about connecting everything up here, that, that, uh, we do need that. here and then we need to connect there as soon as the bridge is done and this piece here uh, seven and Yeah, these batteries down here are loading again, storing energy, so the ones up here, so that means these are running as well, great! So uh, the, the crisis has been averted. Um, only need this piece there built okay then we can connect here construct there produce more energy again so let's enable this one this should help them getting up quicker uh, and that in turn should help dealing with the repairs here on this side but that's the focus for next episode hope you enjoyed this uh, a bit stressful uh, uh, fixing this late in the game did not expect that but it can happen so see you in the next one goodbye